The United States and Cuba have reopened embassies in each other's respective capitals for the first time since 1961. An opening ceremony for the Cuban embassy in Washington was attended by 500 people, including negotiators that helped restore bilateral relations. As for the U.S. embassy in Havana, an opening ceremony has been pushed back until August, when U.S. Secretary of State John Kerry is scheduled to make what will be a truly historic visit there. Citizens in both countries welcome the openings as the nations are expected to see a boost in bilateral tourism and trade as well in the near future. Despite the breakthrough, many thorny issues do remain, namely Cuba's human rights abuses and its will to maintain a tight grip on its state-run economy.